So I got a belt to disguise right on my face. How is that a disguise? But because or because it covers my face. Okay, why is nobody getting this? Listen, Cal, we only have 20 minutes, then we have to let him go. All right. What do you want to do? Nothing. I'll, I'll stay with him. You, you take off early. Oh, by the way, someone stole my sandwich out of the fridge. No, not the one your bubby makes for you every Rosh Hashanah. Yeah. Ah, sorry, man. I know much you talk about those. Yeah. Yeah. You know, we, wor we work with a bunch of savages. No, I know. I mean, but there's always next year. Yeah, I hope. It's just... She's kind of getting up there in age, you know? Yeah, I hear you, man. Well, sorry. I'll help you catch him. Yeah. Well, we got 18 minutes left, John. He's lying. Who? Your partner. He's lying. Wait, you, you think Detective Rubin is the one Come who... Come on. I've been around long enough. I've been around the block. I know when someone is lying. That son of a bitch, why would he do such a thing? Why does anyone do anything, I guess? Yeah, but what kind of man steals another man's sandwich? I mean, that's... It's, it's unforgivable. Hey, aren't you the detective here? Yeah, you're right. We got 18 minutes left. We're gonna make good use of it. Alright, so 9 o'clock I arrived. And then at like 11.30, I left to go see Detective Robin. What happened in between? Did you leave your sandwich unsupervised? Yeah, only for a minute when I went out to go see Detective Robin. <laughs> what? You don't see this? See what? This is an inside job. <laughs> that means the only way he would be able to get in and steal the sandwich, he would have had to been waiting for me. I'm saying, who here knows what time you get your coffee? Who here knows? how long it takes you to get your coffee. So he waited then on the inside for you to leave. That's when he went in and he grabbed and he stole your sandwich. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. What? I, it just seems a bit far-fetched. I'm telling you, that's the way he did it. Yeah. Uh, it's because it was from the inside. I'm telling you. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. That's the only way he could have done it. What makes you so sure of that? It's exactly what I did. I waited for my ex-wife to get back home, and I stabbed her to death, I killed her, and I was, no one noticed that it was a break-in because I did it from the inside. Oh, okay, I, uh, I, I believe you. Holy shit, it actually worked! I, I, I know, can, can you believe that? No, no, I cannot. I did not have much faith in this plan at all. Hey man, look, uh, I just wanted to say, uh, good job out there. I couldn't have done this without you. Couldn't have done it without you either. All right, let's go, buddy. Oh, hey, John, by the way, Rosh Hashanah is not for another two weeks. Oh, God, that's like the perfect line to the end of like a, an episode of a TV show. Honestly, anything after that would just ruin it.